Imagine a scenario where a large AI company has just spent hundreds of millions or maybe even billions of dollars training a model only to turn around and immediately start to break it. That is red teaming. And really, it's one of the smartest things an organization can do to stress test their brand new model or system. Red teaming means testing the AI from a malicious actor or an adversary's point of view. That is, if we are going to hack the system, if we are going to try and exploit some of its weaknesses, how are we going to do that? And what this does is it simulates real world attacks on the models so that an organization can proactively identify and correct weaknesses before someone in the real world does. It's not sabotage, it's safety training. And the goal is to make the system fairer, safer, and more accurate. In AI governance, red teaming is really a form of due diligence. And in an earlier video, we talked about AI model cards. If you go to any of the large AI companies, such as OpenAI or Anthropic, and you look at their model cards, you will see results from the red teaming that they've done. And publishing the results of your red teaming is one way to demonstrate that your organization has been proactive, has tried to identify risk early, and is being a responsible user and deployer of AI systems. If you've enjoyed this video, follow me. Right now I'm covering all 101 terms for the AI governance professional exam.